Since 2012, the Dumb Friends Lake Harmony Equine Center has helped give a second chance to hundreds of Colorado's abused and neglected horses. Well, on Saturday, May 16th, we're all invited to an open house to get a behind-the-scenes look at the facility and learn how the Harmony Equine Center helps horses. Here to tell us more is Megan Reese from the Dumb Friends League, and she brought the cutest little dog up for adoption. <laughs> tell me about Janet is her name, right? Janet, although we are calling her Coco today. I, yeah, so. because I'm trying, I have called my husband and said, I'm bringing home a dog. And he's like, no, we already have dogs. So tell me about Janet. She's so cute. Well, Janet's nine years old. She is a purebred Yorkie. She's really quiet, calm, mellow, um, curious little girl. She still has plenty of energy for her age. Um, she is house trained and good with other small dogs. She is beautiful. I'm telling you, she's, she's not a yapper. She hasn't barked once since she's been here and she's ready to go home. The perfect family would be who do you think? I would think probably maybe a quieter home where she can, you know, she is nine years old, so mm -hmm. not one that's going to be really active and running around all the time. Um, I think she would do well if you have other small dogs um, mm -hmm. and, you know, just somebody that can give her the love and attention that she deserves. She's beautiful. Please call 303-751-5772 and ask to see Janet from Colorado and Company today. She's ready to go home with you. Now let's focus on the Harmony Equine Shelter that you have for horses. Tell me a little bit about it. I know we have an adoptable horse named Maggie. And this is her. Yeah, so Maggie here is uh, seven years old. She is a really great horse. She's in our training program. She is in our training program to be a riding horse. She's been on a few trail rides with our trainers. Um, she's very athletic and would make a great performance horse. And we are seeking um, a little bit of an experienced owner for Maggie. But she's up for adoption, and you can meet her at the open house next weekend. So my husband said no to the dog. Maybe I'll just bring home a horse <laughs> just to see how he likes that. So the Harmony Center, though, it's really unique, kind of one of its kind in the country, right? It is. Is, it's very unique. So what it is, is we take in a formerly abused and neglected horses from law enforcement cases specifically. Oh. Um, these are horses that have been impounded as part of an abuse or neglect case. It's not a rescue or a you know facility that you can bring your horses to is specifically for law enforcement. How do you train the horses to get them ready for adoption? Well, a lot of the horses that come to us um, are in not a very good okay. body condition score. So the first step in our process is to uh, bring them back to health. We want to put weight on them. And then our trainers work with them over a period of months to get them used to humans. A lot of them have never been around humans or been touched before. So it takes months for us, but we are get to a point where these horses can be ridden. Um, we desensitize them to a variety of situations. We have an obstacle course that get, they go through. Uh -huh. They're ridden all the time by our trainers and volunteers, uh -huh. um, get them used to being handled. And it is really quite incredible to see the shape they're in when they leave the facility. Now, how is the process, how difficult is it? to adopt a horse. Is it a difficult process at all? It's certainly different than with cats and dogs. Mm -hmm. um, we, the first step is to give us a call or come to the center and tell us what you're looking for. We want to make sure that we're matching you up with the right kind of horse. Um, whether you're looking for a pasture pet or a riding horse, we do get all sorts of different things at the Harmony Equine Center. So um, we do a site visit. We want to make sure that you have a safe environment for a horse. There is an application process. Um, but you know, if you are interested, give us a call. That's the first step to the process. Okay, and that number 30375 one fifty seven seventy two three oh three seven five one fifty seven seventy two you have an open house where everyone can come and actually see the facility that's right we want to sh be able to show the public exactly what we're doing there at the center so next Saturday May 16th from 11 to 3 we are having an open house it's completely free it is family friendly we're gonna do trainings and demonstrations you can um, learn how to trailer load your horse you can learn all the benefits of being a horse owner we have games for kids like stick horse races oh, cool. um, we've got tours of this facility there's food trucks down there um, and of course you can meet all the adoptable horses and see our new obstacle course where the tr the horses are trained and um, if you can adopt a horse you can always help out in other ways too. just go to their website to find out more thank you very very much and again Janet is up for adoption right here if you'd like to adopt this beautiful full bred Yorkie her name is Janet call 303-751-5772 she is looking for a loving forever home she's a beautiful dog and mark your calendars for the Harmony Equine Center's open house May 16th from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. For all the information you need about the event, go to Dumb Friends League website. It's ddfl.org. The website is ddfl.org. You can also call 303-751-5772.